Matagal na yung mga batas natin sa online education eh. But then until now, nothing has really happened eh. We have not progressed uh, uh, as far as we want eh. So in a way, ito na rin. I, I, wala tayong choice ngayon. Walang choice ang Deep ang DepEd ngayon. Walang choice ang CHED. So this will be the, that opportunity for them to really roll out the implementation of these online classes eh. Kasi Congress kailangan ma-perfect rin nila ngayon eh. Hindi, hindi practice to eh. Totoong yeah. nangyayari eh. We just passed in the committee a bill called Public Schools of the Futures in Technology. Okay. Ito talagang ang gusto natin dito ay yung lalo na yung DepEd schools natin which uh, houses uh, about 21 to 23 million students ay ito yung maumpisahan natin na talagang uh, um, technology na ang gagamitin nila. But then, uh, Sito, if you will notice ang ginawa namin ngayon sa bill, is effectively we made it into uh, parang phases eh, roadmap eh. Kasi dati ho, I remember a long time ago, we started this uh, 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 computer laboratories in in uh, public schools and ngayon nasa na lahat yun, di ba? Uh, imagine yeah. all the uh, wastage that happened. Assuming talagang wala nang, kasi parang ko na napapansin yun eh. Uh, the wastage that happened and sabi mo nga kanina, uh, maaari may corruption pa na nangyari, di ba? That's mm. a possibility. So ang kailangan natin talaga, itong public schools of the future, itong uh, plano namin is talagang ano siya, in phases eh. Talagang yeah. uh, inuutusan natin ang DepEd na gumawa ng roadmap kasi kailangan niya masa... That's why we had Globe and Smart eh, during the committee meeting Kong... kasi gusto natin ma- masabayan nila yung... Uh, yung uh, pagbaba natin ng uh, technology sa bawat paaralan. Okay, Kasi useless na magbigay tayo na wala namang wifi. 